What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about guilds in the Elder Scrolls Online. How I think there could be a few things that would help improve them kind of quality of life uh, improvements and also some things I think would maybe make them feel a little bit more unique. I'm kind of curious what you guys think so definitely leave a comment with your thoughts. Be sure if you're not subscribed to the channel to hit the subscribe button. If you are a subscriber make sure you have notifications turned on. If you enjoy the content I'd appreciate a like and check out everything down in the description the community discord my twitter and of course the affiliate here on the channel Empire Jerky the website along with a 5% discount code is linked in the description as well. Uh, when it comes to guilds, I think guilds could feel a bit more unique and also have some quality of life improvements kind of brought to them. Uh, some of the things I could think quality of life wise would be, I think a lot of people would like to see, I know 500 members is a lot, but probably a member increase. I've talked about stacking uh, inventory in your guild bank before. I think that would be a quality of life improvement that the guild owners would like to see. Um, maybe also some type of, new rank or role system depending on what type of guild you have i know if you own a trade guild in the elder scrolls online that you're probably going to rank members by you know if they've paid their dues for you know so many weeks maybe you will rank them by if you have to have a certain amount of sales you know within the week whatever the case may be but i think a new ranking system for the other types of guilds whether it be a pve guild pvp guild maybe just a uh, you know vet dungeon trial kind of guild there's a lot of different guilds that you can make role playing guilds uh, there's all different kinds of things so i think that would be a big improvement I'm going to go out on a limb and say actually giving us the option to be in more guilds. I know a lot of people are going to say a lot of games you only can be in one guild, the Elder Scrolls, you can be on in, in five. But if you're in two or three trade guilds, maybe you own your own guild. Uh, maybe you own a couple guilds. If you got a lot of big ones, maybe you, know, you want to be in a trial guild or a PvP guild. Five is really not a lot if you think about it because there's a lot of different types of guilds you can be in in game. So I think the option, like I said, to either increase the player count or allow players to be in maybe just a handful of more guilds would be kind of unique or at least something that I think some people would like at least in the community. Another thing that I would like to see that I think would be a great improvement to make guilds feel a little bit more I wouldn't say meaningful but maybe a little bit more unique that would be different types of perks or maybe titles or achievements that you could get for being a member of that guild for supporting that guild. There's a lot of guilds that I am have been in, or, or a couple that I've been in here on PlayStation since the game came out. And there's a lot of dedicated members that have been in those guilds just as long as I have. And I think it would be really neat to have some kind of option, like I said, to give you some type of achievement or some type of reward. Maybe not something like a daily reward, but some type of, you know, just reward to show off that you have been in this guild and supported this guild for a long period of time. Now, I know we have the tabard, you know, as you actually put on to show your guild off, to show your guild title off, that kind of thing. But I think some type of, of something reward-wise, or like I said, just achievements to show off uh, that you've supported the same guild for, you know, however long, would be kind of neat. And I think that would make the guild feeling, the feel of the guild, I guess, a little bit more unique. And I'm kind of curious, too, a lot of people always, you know, worry about allowing players to withdraw and deposit certain things within their bank. I think a lot of people are really concerned about people withdrawing, you know, everything and leaving the guild. If there was an option to where you could with, uh, set it to certain, you know, ranks could withdraw certain things. I know that might be something a little bit more difficult to do within the game's code. I'm not sure. But like if you had tons of style pages, let's just say from the, you know, Jester's Festival and of course the Jubilee event. And you wanted to set it, put all those in your bank and set it so all of the members that might need them could get those certain items out, but not all the other items out of the bank that you may have in there. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know what you think would make guilds feel a little bit more user-friendly and maybe uh, some ways unique. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.